Hey there, football fans. Welcome back to Soccer News Center. Today, we have some breaking news that has been making waves in the football world. FIFA has opened disciplinary proceedings against Luis Rubiales, the president of the Spanish Football Association, RFEF, following incidents at the Women's World Cup Final. In case you missed it, Rubiales has been heavily criticized for his actions during the presentation ceremony after Spain beat England. He kissed striker Jenny Hermoso on the lips and later grabbed his crotch in celebration. These actions have sparked outrage and calls for Rubiales to resign. The Global Players Union FIPRO has called for immediate action, stating that it is deeply lamentable that such a special moment should be stained by the inappropriate conduct of an individual in a position of responsibility. Spain's High Council for Sports has already received complaints about Rubiales, and the RFEF has convened an emergency meeting to address the situation. But now, FIFA has stepped in and opened disciplinary proceedings against Rubiales. According to FIFA's statement, Rubiales may have violated Article 13 of the FIFA Disciplinary Code, which deals with violations of decent conduct and insulting behavior. FIFA strongly condemns any behavior that goes against the integrity of individuals. Rubiales had initially dismissed the criticism, calling it nonsense from idiots and stupid people. However, Jenny Hermoso has expressed her discomfort with the incident, stating that she didn't like it. She clarified that it was a mutual gesture between friends celebrating a World Cup victory. Pressure has been mounting on Rubiales, with calls for his resignation coming from high-profile individuals in Spanish sport and society. Even the president of La Liga side Hatafa has called for him to step down, emphasizing the damaged image that this incident has caused. As the disciplinary proceedings unfold, we will keep you updated on any further developments. Stay tuned to Soccer News Center for the latest news in the world of football. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.